Hey guys, it's Alex here from alexfergus.com and today I'm going to do a full comparison of the three Juve red light lights. So the full, uh, the full product range, uh, I've got the Juve Mini behind me, I've got the Juve Original and I've got the Juve Max. Uh, these are all the combo lights, 660 nanometer and the 850 nanometer wavelength, which is why you see the, uh, the pattern on the, um, on the lights there. So, um, I'm going to turn them off soon, but uh, first I'll just give you a quick overview of what I'm going to cover. So we're going to look at the physical size, uh, dimensions and all that. We're going to look at LED count. Uh, we're going to look at the cost per panel. Uh, sorry, I've got a list here because there's so much we're going to cover. Cost per panel, cost per light, um, the EMF output. So I've got my Cornet Electrosmog, oh, Cornet Electrosmog meter here to test the non-native EMF. So we're going to test EMF levels on it. I'm going to test the noise. Um, we're going to test the time uh, needed to do a full body, like the exposure from the light, um, and share a few other thoughts along the way. Uh, by the way, if you haven't, I've got a bunch of videos on YouTube. Uh, there's a whole playlist, like my Juve review playlist, I think it's called, where I like go into unboxing, go into my experiences using these lights. Um, various other things. So if you want to, you know, take a deep dive into one of these panels, be sure to check them out. Uh, I do have a full article on red light therapy and the health benefits around it. That's over at alexfergus.com. If you're watching this on YouTube, I'll put a link below in the notes. Please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, all that jazz. Um, and I do have a discount code for Juve as well. So if you found this useful, uh, beneficial, and um, you know, you want to get one of these lights, and uh, you want to save a few dollars, just use my first name, Alex, A-L-E-X, and they'll save you a few dollars. Anyway, um, I'm going to go turn these off because I'm sure I'm burning through some power and it probably looks a bit messy with the whole red light thing going on. So I'm going to go turn these off and we're going to start with the, uh, the mini and look at the physical size. Alright, so, let me pull this in a bit. There we go. So, I've been using the Juve panels for a few weeks, months now. Uh, I started with the original, uh, then I got a, then I got the Max actually, and then I got the Mini to uh, do this comparison with. And also, um, I want to do a full setup, which I'll talk about another day. Uh, anyway, so physical size differences. So obviously, the Mini is just turn the power off, is uh, quite small in comparison to. The other ones, I mean, it's not as small as the handheld lights you can get from uh, Red Light Man, for instance. Um, but we have two, I don't know what to call these, uh, panels, I guess. Two panels on here, whereas the original has one, two, three, four, five, and the Max has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, sixteen. So yeah, it's, it's quite a lot smaller, um, not too heavy, you know, I can easily pick this up in one hand. I've got the measurements here, so uh, what do we got? The Mini is, <coughs> has a height of 15 inches, width of 8 inches, and 3 inches thick, um, which is, I don't know if you want centimeters as well, it's about 40 centimeters high, 20 centimeters across, 8 centimeters deep. Okay, uh, it comes with all the standard things that the other ones do, like the timer and everything. But I've got an unboxing video and a setup video for, for that, for the mini. So you can go watch that rather than me going through all this again. Uh, what else do we need to know? LED count on this one is 60 LEDs. So again, I've got 30 660 and 30 850. I went for the combos because I think, you know, you get the best... Uh, you get a, the best of both worlds that way. You, some people just do 660, some people just the near infrared light. And again, I've, if you're wondering why, what the benefits are of each, check out that article on my website, alexfergus.com, where I break it all down. Um, but if you just want a well-rounded machine, go with the combo one. So all three of those combos. So 60 LED lights. Um, cost. Cost of this is, after you use the discount code, A-L-E-X, Alex, uh, the cost of this is 570 US dollars. Uh, what else? What else? What else? So cost per LED. So I worked out a, a bit of a calculation here. Um, cost per LED, $9.50 per LED. All right. So we'll come back and do a full comparison for all this. Uh, noise. Let's just turn the power on again. Noise. I, I don't know. I don't have a decibel meter or anything like that. So you're just going to have to go 
uh, based on what comes through on the recording. It's pretty quiet. Uh, there's only two fans on the back, so there's a fan for each panel. So it's pretty quiet. I mean, it's like a background noise, like a bit of a whir. So nothing too crazy there. Uh, and now I've got my EMF meter. Now I've done a full uh, video looking at the EMF outputs on the original. I haven't done it on there, so I'm going to do that now. Um, it's a little bit tricky getting this all set up because it's hard to see the screen and everything. So you're just going to have to trust, take my word here, and um, trust me with the reading because I don't want to set it all up and do all that um, complicated stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold it. Uh, they re Jude recommends, I think it's about six to eight, ten centimeters, a couple inches from the panel. Um, I don't have the booklet with me, so I'm going to I'm going to do a standard distance. <laughs> So I've got a ruler here, so I'm going to do the, a standard distance of, say, uh, let's do, we'll just half this, it's 15 centimeters. Alright, so we'll go 15 centimeters out and we'll, we'll take a read in there, okay? So again, you'll just have to trust me on this. Yeah, because you're not going to see anything. Alright, so I'm looking at the low frequency, low frequency range, which is the LF30 for people who have these, these uh, devices. I got a bit of ruler. This one's 16 centimeters long, so I'm just going to use this, alright? Uh, alright. So without it on, without it on, it is 0 0.08, 0 0.09 just picked up 0.1 and again I'm not saying that's just from this device I mean there's all sorts of appliances in this room right now it could be wiring and stuff so um you know it is what it is and so I'm just gonna see what the difference is so we're up to point one three which is still in the green to yellow zone it's just flickering between green and yellow so it's actually not too bad, all right? So I'm gonna write that down here. Uh, where are we? 0.13 G yellow. All right, so that's the mini. Uh, oh, last thing is exposure, light exposure. So according to the Juve website, the treatment area for this is 25, let's hope I did this right. 25 inches by 18 inches, which is 63 centimeters by 45 centimeters, because the light comes out on an angle, all right? But um, if you're just looking at this, I mean, you're not gonna be able to do your full body. So what I like to do is I like to do my knees to the top of my head, okay? So if I use this, it's gonna take me a while. Uh, you know, you're gonna have to do chunks. And then if you're doing front and back, you know, chunks again. So if you're doing your typical five to 10 minute session, uh, body exposure, gonna take, I don't know, one, two, three, four, you know, it could take half an hour to an hour if you do the whole full body uh, using this one. Uh, if you just want to focus on one particular area like, you know, your, your face or your, the balls, testicles, because it's been shown to boost testosterone there, um, you know, something like this is perfect uh, for people who are worried, you know, want to minimize wrinkles and all that, it could be good. All right, so. $570 using the code, 60 LEDs, works out at $9.50 per LED, uh, and pretty low EMF. So that's the Mini. Next one here, we've got the original. Okay, so this is the most popular one, uh, well, well priced, good size. All right, so let's run through everything here. Physical size, height 37.5 inches, which is 95 centimeters. Width is, Eight inches, same width as the mini here, uh, which is 20 centimeters, and depth, same as that. They're all the same depth. They're all a three inch depth, eight centimeters, okay? Um, all right, what else do we need to know? LED count, 150 versus the 60. All right, so over over double that, because uh, you got the one, two, three, four, five panels versus the two here. Price, using discount code LEX, is 970. All right, so that brings the price per LED down to 650. Remember the mini was 950. So it's a big cost saving. All right. Um, 
Nice. Let's test this out. So a little bit louder than that one, you've got the five fans. Maybe what I'll do at the end is I'll turn all three on, or one by one, so you can kind of hear the difference. Um, so it's still pretty good. EMF, I have tested it before, but I'll do it again. Uh, all right. So we're sitting at 0 0.07 there, 0 0.08. It's up to point, oh Jesus, point 14. Point 12. Yeah, it's about point 12 to point 14. So it's actually not that much higher than the mini. I'm going to put 0.14, it might not even be that much, but anyway, I've done a full video uh, testing this where I go through all the settings, um, so if you're really worried about the EMF, go watch that, but over, uh, overall, there's, they're pretty good, I mean, they are good. It's, so this device, uh, I've, set, I've set the ranges here based on uh, some guidelines from a pretty switched on uh, EMF sort of website, I, I can't even remember where I got all the information from so long ago. But anyway, you, you want to be in the green, and if you're in the yellow, like, you don't want too much exposure. You know, you don't want yellow in your office or yellow in your bedroom and stuff. Red, you know, you want minimal amount, like a few minutes max. So, um, right now, for instance, it's flicking between green and, and yellow, and that's because I've got so many electronics wired and this camera going on and my phone's over there as well. So, anyway, so when that turned on, it jumped up a little bit, but it was still flickering between the yellow and the orange. Again, if you're doing 10, 15 minutes there, I'm not worried about that. It's, it's such low, low uh, ranges, exposures. Um, okay, and then uh, treatment area with this is 48 inches by 18 inches, which is 1.2 meters by 45 across. Now, um, pretty much with those numbers, you could almost do like the top of your head down to your genital area, which I, I believe to be like the, the money area. That doesn't really make sense. The key sort of zone you want to hit. You want to do the face, you know, for wrinkles and all that. You want to do your head if you're trying to get some hair growth. Um, you want to do your throat for thyroid. You want to do uh, your stomach. You know, you've got all your organs in there. And then you want to do genital area for sex hormone production, you know, reproductive, reproductive health and all that. But what I found with this is when it was hanging on the wall, I actually couldn't do both. I mean, it wouldn't, like I had to choose either, either the top of my head or my genital area. So I couldn't really get both in. However, according to the treatment area on the juice stats, um, I would be okay if I was standing my 10, 15 centimeters back from it because they sort of angle out. I probably would have got exposure on, on both those areas. But, you know, maybe just sort of looking eye level with the lights, I, I thought I wasn't. Um, it wasn't until I pulled these stats up when I realized, you know what, you're probably okay with it. And then it also angles out. So, you know, I measured the width, the breadth of me, and um, I was about 48, 50 centimeters, shoulder to shoulder, okay. And so saying the treatment area and the recommended uh, usage, the recommended um, distance is 45 degrees width which is the same as the mini as well so that's quite wide so i mean based on these numbers i mean you're pretty much getting the the main areas covered but it just feels weird because it's a little bit shorter and it's not the full width so what i was actually doing is i was doing half and then moving half across and then spinning around and doing half and then half and then i was lowering it and doing like my genitals and stuff so it was taking me quite a bit of time you know 30 40 minutes each morning um so based on those stats you may not have to do that. You could just do your front and back and know that everything is getting covered. But you're not going to get as much coverage as you do with the Max. Which I'm going to get into next. But I just want to check the time because I have to go for an appointment soon. I'm getting my first Reiki session done. If anyone's ever had that before, I'd um, love to hear your thoughts. My partner's done a few sessions and she loves it. So uh, I promised her I would go check it out. Anyway, Max. Alright, so where were we at? Uh, Physical size, as you can see, it's huge. I don't even think you can see the top of it in there. But again, I've got a full video on this one. 
uh, where I set it up and it's a it's a beast it comes in a massive box uh, I can manage it on my own but you know you probably want two people if you're hanging it up and stuff um, but it's well put together all of these are metal and, and they're really solid and they use really good lights as well not like some of the cheap sort of Amazon you know grow lights that you see okay so what are we gonna do physical size we've got a height and what I'll do is I'll put these in a little uh, Hopefully they come up on the screen. We'll do a table and everything and you can see everything in one handy place. So physical size, we've got a height of 53 inches, which is 1.3 meters high. Uh, width of 16 inches, so it's twice the width of this, which is 40 centimeters. And the depth is three inches, which is the same. All three are the same. Okay, LED count, 480. <laughs> 480 LEDs in this puppy. It's totally as big. So remember this one was 60. This one was 150, this one was 480, okay? Price, using, uh, this is the price after you use my discount code, 260, $2,670, all right? Big chunk of money. Price per LED, $5.50. So $9.50 per LED, $6.50 per LED, $5.50 per LED with the max. Uh, noise. I mean, you got 16 fans here, so it is a little bit louder. I'm gonna get up and turn it on now. So it is, it is a little bit louder, and I'm just seeing my camera's gonna die, damn it. Um, I'm gonna go charge this. All right, I'm back. Hopefully I got enough juice here to uh, get me through before it cuts out again. Alright, so we were looking at noise. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do all three so you can see the difference. I'm going to be quiet as I go through it. Okay, so we'll start with the mini. So it is a little bit louder, but it's not overbearing you know I have it going in the morning it's not waking my partner up or anything like that I have it going when we're watching TV or music you still have a conversation it's not crazy loud but there's a lot of fans whirring so uh, there is a little bit more noise okay uh, we're gonna test the EMF now so I'll try and get it in the middle here So we're in the green zone around 0 0.09. Oh, I'm on the wrong setting. Okay, so it jumped up to about 0.13 to 0.15, so slightly high. So pretty, uh, pretty good stuff. So we're 0 0.13, 0 0.14, 0 0.15, so tiny, tiny difference. And they're all still in that yellow green zone. Treatment area for this, um, 63 inches by 26 inches, which is 1.6 meters height and 90 centimeters wide. Full body, all right? So with this, I'm doing top of my head, chest, all my, you know, right across my body, all the way down to my knees, all right? Uh, even, and based on that treatment area, I mean, pretty much you're doing your whole body. I'm 178, so I'm only losing about 20 centimeters of coverage. Huge, huge, huge panel, all right? I mean, if you want full body, if you want time efficiency, this one's the way to go. Because you just stand in front of that, spin around, do your back, and you've done. You've done your whole body. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have this for front and back, and then I'm gonna have this one on the side. So as I'm doing my front, this one, the original's on my side. All right, so I think that's everything. So. What would I suggest buying? Uh, based on the price, 950 per LED, 650, 550, this is probably like the sweet spot. I mean, it's under a grand. This you're looking at over two and a half grand. Um, 570 for this, you might as well pay 400 bucks extra and get, oh, what was that? And get um, a ton more LEDs, 60 LEDs versus 150. If budget isn't an issue and you want the best of the best, then yeah, go for the max. Um, I, if I were to buy one, again, after having them all, um, I'd, I'd go to the max. It just, I'm using it every day and it just saves time. You get the full body, turn around, done. Uh, whereas this one, you know, you, because of the height thing, you're sort of chopping and changing and, and moving it up around. 
um, but saying that it is a big chunk of money to go with this. If you can't afford it, then um, settle with this one because then you're getting such better price per LED. So pretty much many, like to be honest, if you're gonna spend $570, um, save up a little bit longer or, or, or stretch the uh, budget a little bit more and get the original at 970 just because you get so much more exposure like you could pretty much do your your majority of your your body using this um whereas that i mean you're so restricted and even if you think oh, i'm just going to use it for my face or you know help with an injury uh yeah i mean sure it's great but then why not spend a little bit more money and then know you've got something that can do the whole body and if it's not going to be for you maybe or for your flatmate or your partner or your, your child or something so anyway uh yeah and from a cost per led point of view this one you know 950 versus 650 and then this the max um yeah i mean that's a big jump in price like we're going from 970 up to two and a half just a little bit over two and a half thousand so it is a big jump in, in price um but you know, um, if you want the, the big one, then obviously that's the one to go for. Otherwise, you could you could get this and then later on get a second one of these and you can kind of go side by side or, or, you know, like one in front of the other. Sorry, one for your front, one for the back. Uh, anyway, um, I don't know what else I have to say here. Uh, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. Uh, again, check out my other YouTube videos on unboxing and reviewing the Mini, uh, unboxing, reviewing and setting up the Max, uh, EMF testing on the original, and then also my my own personal thoughts and um, experiences using the original. I didn't want this to be a review, I just wanted to make it more of a comparison. Um, by the way, discount code Alex will save you, like I've mentioned a few times now, will save you a few dollars. All the pricing I've done, pricing calculations uh, that I've done have been using that code. I will mention though, I am affiliated with uh, Joof, so if you do use that code, um, you save, but I also get a little kickback. Now, if you don't agree with that and you don't want to support that, then that's cool. Just don't use the code and, um, and don't use any of my links or anything like that, uh, but you will pay a higher price. Anyway, so it's, it's entirely up to you. Uh, I just wanted to make this video like educational and try to make it informative. Uh, again, I'm not sharing my, my thoughts around, you know, if these are the best or the worst or anything because I've done that in other videos. Uh, so hopefully, you know, if you're looking at buying one of these devices, um, this video has helped. Again, give me a thumbs up if it has. If you have any questions that I haven't covered, uh, if there's anything that I haven't covered, ask them below. Um, be sure to hit subscribe as well because I put out a bunch of videos on my YouTube channel every now and then. And um, yeah, happy red lighting. So what I might do to finish is just have all three of them going. Let's see if this works. One, two, three. I might actually do a session, so. Bye guys.